Hello everyone! Today we are going to look at table variables. Um, so these are another good way, like hash tables, of creating a temporary table um, that is used within your session and then just goes away magically. <laughs> uh, but it is important to note that um, like whilst these are very useful, they do not behave exactly like a table. Um, they're not affected by transactions, um, so they can't be rolled back. Um, etc. So do be aware of that if you're doing a lot of stuff within a script um, and thinking you can roll stuff back in a table variable because you can't. So um, how we create these here is we declare them um, in the same way as you would declare a variable. So we've got declare at table var as table and then um, the table definition between brackets like you would normally create a table. Um, so I've just got two columns in this one. Um, and so we can insert data into it um, just like you would typically with a uh, normal table. Let's put words. Um, and then let's have, oh, I don't know, uh, chips. Uh, union select to cheese. Can you tell I'm hungry? <laughs> and then we can just select star from at table bar. Oh, from. I think I even said it but just didn't write it. <laughs> can hangry, you see. <laughs> um, right, okay, so if um, I insert the data there, I can select it in the same sort of way as a table. Um, I can also um, update it and I'll just show you actually if I um, begin tram um, update uh, at table var um, set words um, let's show have a look equals gravy gravy where id equals one and then we'll look at it and then we'll roll it back and then we'll look at it again so let's run that here we can see here that um we have updated um chips to gravy but even though we have told it to roll it back it's not done the roll back there um, and that's just because it's a variable, I guess, not a table, so it doesn't behave in the same way. Um, so what we can also do is we can delete from them as well. So if I do delete from um, there, uh, we can take the roll back out because we know that it's not working. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can delete records from it as well. So that's pretty much it. Very exciting, right? Um, if you enjoyed this tutorial, please like and subscribe to our channel. Feel free to add any comments below, especially if there's something in particular you want me to cover. Um, and the next tutorial in this series is going to be date functions. So thank you for watching.